My name is Brendan Brookgator. I've been here at the way for six months. Came in on a Sunday to walk through the front doors. It was about 3.34, service was over. I didn't know what to expect. I just uh, came in, I didn't have no, I didn't have nothing on my mind what to even ask for. Pastor Janet took me to uh, Larry. He was like, well, you gotta come back Tuesday. I was like, man, I'm not going back out them doors because uh, if I leave out, I'm not going to come back. I walked over there to them chairs outside of Pastor Janet's uh, door and I sat down. I said, well, I'm going to wait right here till Tuesday. That was the smartest decision I ever made. When I was homeless and, and on drugs, the day I came in that Sunday, but that, that Friday night, I was uh, assaulted. It was... Uh, I was hit in the head with a machete and stabbed in the side. God was there, he saved me because, uh, and I have no doubt that he saved me because it was six, six to eight hours after the assault happened that I was found by the police in MLMs. It was so late that they couldn't put the staples in the, uh, in stitches. God didn't create me to just be out here like this. That's how I know that God had a purpose for me. Not only did he, that it saved me physically, but spiritually and like, I know my purpose in life now. You know, God didn't create me or save me just to go back to being on drugs. It's a feeling that I can't really even explain. I can honestly say that I'm happy. I got three kids when each one of them was born. I'm not taking away from that, but this is a different type of happiness. Like a newborn baby, I just want to do all I can to serve and and stay in place with God. I don't want to be out of His absence. The most important thing for me that, that I've learned or I'm focused on about being in the man's home and being here at the churches, I got to die to myself are my old ways, which is good, because uh, right now, everything that Pastor Marcos and Pastor Gavin Tate been s preaching and saying, I'm, I'm holding on to each word they say, and I'm, I'm, I'm bringing it in, I'm meditating on it, then I'm applying it to my son. I'm a leader, I'm enjoying my relationship with God, you know, and by me enjoying my relationship with God, fellowshipping with God, he directed my life. I gave it all to him. So it's it's a wonderful thing right now.